सो नाजरीन आज कम्यूनिटी राउंड अप पर हम आज जनाब हारून खान के घर तशरीफ़ लाए हैं और हारून खान साहब ने एक बहुत ही अच्छा यहाँ पर हंड्रेड एंड फिफ्टी एथ बर्थडे ऑफ कैनरा के लिहाज से एक प्रोग्राम किया है उसके मुताल बताएंगे हारून भाई असल वरह वर्क कैसे हैं आप मैं बिल्कुल ठीक हूँ अलकुम आपको और आपके तमाम सुनने वालों को जी आ, आज क्या प्रोग्राम है आप आज प्रोग्राम कुछ भी नहीं है हम जो हैं कनाडा के 150 फिफ्टी ईयर सेलिब्रेट कर रहे हैं जैसे हर मुल्क में उसका दिन सेलिब्रेट किया जाता है कनाडा का जो दिन है वो जुलाई फर्स्ट है लेकिन जुलाई फर्स्ट को तो सब लोग सेलिब्रेट करते हैं तो हमने एक दो हफ्ते बाद रखा और आइडिया सिर्फ इसका ये है हमेशा कि जिस मुल्क में है महरा मुझे यहाँ फोर्टी फाइव ईयर्स हो गए तो उस मुल्क का हमें शुक्रिया अदा करना है कि, कि इन्होंने हमको ज़िंदगी कि सब कुछ चीज़ें दी ये इनमें ख़राबियाँ होंगी जो लोगों को मैं सुनता हूँ कभी वो उन्हें ख़राबियाँ नज़र आती हैं लेकिन मेरा जवाब ये उन तमाम ख़राबियों के बावजूद दिस इज़ द बेस्ट कंट्री ऑन अर्थ टू लिव आज का क्या प्रोग्राम है आज का हमारा प्रोग्राम ये है कि इस वक्त हमारे तमाम दोस्त हैं ये बारबेक्यू हो रहा है खाना वगैरह खा रहे हैं इसके बाद कुछ डिग्नेटीज हमने बुलाई हैं पार्लियामेंट मेम्बर्स हैं मिनिस्टर्स हैं अम्बेसडर्स हैं और हाईलाइट इसकी ये है कि इसमें लेफ्टिनेंट गवर्नर ऑफ ऑन्टेरियो जो हैं वो आज तशरीफ लाएंगी जो कि बड़ा यूनिक है कि वो हर तर, हर तरह से लेफ्टिनेंट गवर्नर कभी इस तरह जाता नहीं है यही मुझे सरप्राइज़ है कि वो किसी के पास जाते नहीं हैं जाते हैं ये फर्स्ट टाइम है कि लेफ्टिनेंट गवर्नर कभी किसी के घर और किसी कम्यूनिटी से मिलने आ रहा है वो आएंगे उनकी छोटी सी स्पीच है एक आध दो चार मिनट की उसके बाद वो यहाँ आकर गार्डन में वो लोगों से मिंगल अराउंड करेंगे और उनके पास काफ़ी टाइम होगा हमारे लोगों से मिंगल अराउंड करने का एंड द कम्युनिटी के लिए ये बड़ा अच्छा दिन है डेफिनेटली एंड यहाँ पर बहुत सारे लोगों से मुलाकात हो रही है और डिग्नेटरीज आ रहे हैं आपने कहा और उन तमाम से हम बातचीत भी करवाएंगे और इसके बाद जनाब हारून खान का शुक्रिया अदा करते हैं कि इन्होंने इतने अच्छी गैदरिंग यहाँ पर की हुई है अपने बैक यार्ड में की हुई है एंड अगेन जैसे हारून भाई ने बताया कि रिफ्रेंट गवर्नर जो है वो किसी के घर जाते नहीं हैं दिस इज़ द फर्स्ट टाइम रिफ्रेंट गवर्नर इज़ कमिंग टू हारून भाई हाउस दिस इज नॉट ओनली ऑनर फॉर हारून भाई फॉर द होल of our community thank you very much thank you i'll enjoy kijiye aap log sab thank you thank you thank you उर्दू खबरनामे के राना सुहेल साहब आपके क्या तसर हैं इस तकरीब के बारे में जी आज की तकरीब कनाडा के वन फिफ्टी बर्थडे के हवाले से है और उसकी सबसे खूबसूरत बात यह है कि हमारे एक दोस्त हारून भाई ने इसको अरेंज किया है और इसके अंदर आलमोस्ट नाइन्टी परसेंट पाकिस्तानी कम्यूनिटी इकट्ठी है इस वक्त और पाकिस्तान की पार्टिसपेशन है इसके अंदर और हमारी जो लेफ्टिनेंट गवर्नर हैं एलिसबे डोनस वो तशरीफ़ ला रही हैं और ये हमारा स्ट्रीम लाइन में एंटर होने का बहुत अच्छा तरीका कार है और लोगों को ये बताना कि वी आर द कैनेडियंस एज अदर कैनेडियंस आर और हमें ऐसा ही करना चाहिए और इसी तरह अपनी कंट्रीब्यूशन देनी चाहिए ना सिर्फ इसमें बल्कि हर जगह पे जहाँ पर भी कैनाडा की बात है शुक्रिया बहुत शुक्रिया इस वक्त मेरे साथ टोरटो के दो मशहूर लॉयर तारक शाह साहब और फैसल मिर्जा साहब मौजूद हैं तो मैं उनकी राय जानना चाहूँगा इस तकरीब के बारे में तारक शाह साहब हमें बड़ी खुशी है जी कि कम्युनिटी ने एक प्रोग्राम अरेंज किया है और गवर्नर जनरल साहब तशरीफ ला रहे हैं और हमें इस बात की भी खुशी है कि काफ़ी कम्युनिटी जो है वो लोग आए हैं और इस तरह के फंक्शन होते रहने चाहिए ताकि लोगों को एहसास हो कम्यूनिटी को एक्टिव होना चाहिए और इन मुख्तलफ तहरीक अब सॉरी मुख्तलिफ जो हैं ये प्रोग्राम्स इनमें हिस्सा लेना चाहिए ताकि इससे बढ़ती है एक नुमाइंदगी बढ़ती है कम्यूनिटी की शुक्रिया यस इट्स वेरी नाइस फ्रॉम मिस्टर खान टू होस्ट दिस इवेंट एट इस होम इट शोज दैट वी हैव अ स्ट्रॉग इन्वायरमेंट कम्यूनिटी 
um, that is um, composed of people of all different backgrounds and professions and that we come together to celebrate Canada's 150th birthday um, because we're proud Canadians as well. Thank you. इस वक्त हमारे साथ टोरंटो के मशहूर और पाइनियर ब्रॉडकास्टर जनाब बशीर साहब मौजूद हैं तो मैं ख्वाहिश जाहिर करूँगा कि आप अपनी राय का इजहार फरमाएं सबसे पहले तो मैं आप लोगों को मुबारकबाद पेश करना चाहूँगा कैनाडा डे की 150 एंड फिफ्टी ईयर्स ऑफ स्ट्रगल बेस्ट ह्यूमन राइट रिकॉर्ड चार्टर ऑफ राइट्स विच इज़ वन ऑफ द बेस्ट in the world to protect citizens and uh, all the opportunities which do exist for all Canadians from various nationalities creed religion and faith background they come to canada make this canada our new home and uh, mashallah our immigrants people are the strength for the economy for diversity which provides the strength to multicultural multi faith canada as a role model nation in the world my heart is congratulation aap sabko 150vi salgira canada ki mubarak ho aur i wish you well and success thank you thank you very much is waqt urdu post ke tauseef sahab hamare sath hain to main unse darkhwast karunga ki apne khayalat ka izhar farmaye aaj ki taqreeb ke mutalliq ji sabse badi baat ye hai ki harun bhai पाकिस्तानी कम्युनिटी का फ़ख्र हैं पिछले कई सालों से बहुत उम्दा हर साल वो प्रोग्राम करवाते हैं इस दफ़ा कनाडा की चूँकि एक सौ पचासवीं साल गिरा है और उन्होंने इसको बड़े मुनफरद अंदाज़ में मनाने का प्रोग्राम किया लेफ्टिनेंट गवर्नर ओंटारियो की पहली मरतबा किसी के घर और और पहले पाकिस्तानी उनके घर वो मेहमान खसूस के तौर पर आ रही हैं हारून भाई समाजी हवाले से बड़ा एक नाम रखते हैं गुजत पैंतालीस से पचास साल से वो कनाडा में मुकीम हैं और इन्होंने पाकिस्तान में कई गरीब बच्चों के लिए स्कूल बनाए ट्रस्ट बनाया हुआ है और यहाँ पर पुलिस से रिलेटेड जो भी हमारी कम्युनिटी के इश्यूज़ होते हैं उनको रिजॉल्व करने के लिए बहुत ज़्यादा एक्टिव हैं जितने भी प्रोग्राम अभी तक हुए हैं उनमें हारून भाई ने मुनफरद अंदाज़ में प्रोग्राम किए हमें उन पर फ़ख्र है और वो उनका कहना यह है कि हमने जो कुछ कनाडा से हासिल किया हमें पे बैक भी करना है सिर्फ रूटीन के काम नहीं करने तो पाकिस्तानी कम्युनिटी के लिए एक मुनफरद अंदाज़ का प्रोग्राम और यहाँ पे जो लोगों की आमद है हाई प्रोफाइल लोग हमेशा आए हैं उसमें पाकिस्तान को पाकिस्तानियत को पाकिस्तानी कल्चर को प्रमोट करना कनाडा के साथ साथ चूँकि हम कनाडा में रहते हैं ये हमारा फ़ख्र है हमें भी कनाडा के प्रोग्राम नेशनल डे उसी तरह मनाना है जिस तरह हम और दूसरे प्रोग्राम भी सेलिब्रेट करते हैं तो मैं उन्हें मुबारकबाद देता हूँ एक बहुत अच्छा प्रोग्राम उन्होंने मनद किया और गवर्नर यहाँ आके अब उनके हवाले से और पाकिस्तानी कम्यूनिटी के हवाले से क्या कहती हैं हम ये उनकी ज़ुबानी सुनेंगे बहुत शुक्रिया बहुत बहुत शुक्रिया तसीफ Assalamu alaikum um, first of all we would like to thank you Mr Harun Khan for such a wonderful gathering on behalf of uh, Canada 150th birthday aur alhamdulillah everybody is here we are having fun aur bahut acha unhone intezam kiya hai and we always say you know Canada is the best country thank you aap log kuch assalamu alaikum mera naam ruksana hai and of course i gonna say thanks to harun bhai and kulsum they always do amazing amazing functions and this is also one of the best event and it's especially for canada day thank you so much assalamu alaikum mera naam rukaiya hai ji ha hum log yahan bahut enjoy kar rahe hain we've been having lot of fun and with lot of food and everything thanks to harun bhai and kulsum bhabhi thank you Thank you, Harun Bhai. We are enjoying a very good party here. We love Canada. You are applauding me. Thank you very much. Very nice. Welcome, everybody, uh, to a very special Canada 150 celebration. Yes. My name is Jake Deer. It really is. At this point, I'd like to introduce our very special uh, dignitaries that are here, starting with our members of Parliament, Ikra Khalid and Gagan Sekhan, and then we have members of Provincial Parliament, the Honourable Deputy Merla and Amrit Mangat. 
We have some very special dignitaries. Mr. Imran Ahmed, Consul General of Pakistan. Mr. Lloyd Wills, Consul General of Jamaica. Mr. ULM Johar, Consul General of Sri Lanka. Mr. Sultan Ali Al Harbi, Consul General of the UAE. We have city councilor who's down there, should really be up here, but he was eating too much food. When he gets a chance, he can come up. Councilor for Ward 6, Ron Starr is here. We have our security agencies. Uh, I'm not sure if uh, Mr. Omrik Alavali is here, Peel Regional Police Services Board. Sam Fernandez, Superintendent of Toronto Police. Mr. Ron Tavener, Superintendent of Toronto Police. Richard uh, Hedges, Inspector of Toronto Police. Oh, Richard's right there. And then we have a constable for the Toronto Police, Mr. Johnny Bobley. From overseas, we've got folks all the way here from around the world. Uh, we have Mr. Nazar Ahmed, Baron Ahmed, British House of Lords. We have Mr. S. M. Munir. He's the former CEO of uh, TDAP, the Trade, the Trade Department Authority of Pakistan. Pakistan Trade. Very nice to have everybody here. And, uh, of course, we know who this gentleman is. He is the gentleman who's hosting us today in his beautiful home, and I'll speak about him a little bit later on, and that is Haroon Khan and his lovely bride, Kulsum, who I cannot find where she is. And, of course, we all know who she is, our wonderful honorary Canadian, our wonderful Canadian, our wonderful former Mayor Hazel McCallion. And at this point, I'd like to welcome to a very, very hot deck, and it's going to get hotter when she enters, is the wonderful, honorable Lieutenant Governor. Would you please welcome the Honorable Elizabeth Dowdsdale. Folks, I'm going to invite uh, two uh, wonderful young ladies. Uh, they've been singing O Canada for, I think, about 10 plus years for the Toronto Police Services, and they're going to do it here today. Would you please welcome Aima Khan and Maha Sheikh. Thank you very much, and thank you to all of you who sang along, and for those of you who didn't, what were you doing? I know you all love Canada. You want to make some noise if you love Canada? Yeah! Yeah! All right. Folks, uh, as you know, each year, I think about twice a year, if not more, actually more than that, Haroon Khan opens his house, or I should say Haroon and, and Kulsum, his lovely bride, and you know whether it's Eid celebrations or Canada Day celebrations, in fact Haroon, along with his wonderful family, they were the first ones to celebrate Canada, at least to my knowledge, the first ones to celebrate Canada Day in the South Asian community 20 years ago or so. I had hair back then, and, and I've got video to prove that, but, but you know, we used to have like a thousand people or so come up, sometimes more, and it was incredible because this is the man that used to do it. And he continues to do that, whether it's Eid celebrations or wonderful days like today. We've often celebrated Hazel McCallion's birthday here as well with a wonderful cake and so on. And today, we're, you know, once again, Haroon and Kulsum are opening up their homes 
and the big hearts that they have. They are absolutely incredible. And it's, it's a great honor for the South Asian community because this is something that our wonderful Lieutenant Governor, Lieutenant Governor, you know, does not go to homes generally. And this is, the, this is very unique. And we really appreciate you doing that. And thank you so much for doing that. And it speaks, yes. And it speaks to the passion and, and the wonderful Canadian that Haroon and Kulsum are as well. So at this point, I would like to invite our host. Please welcome Mr. Haroon Khan. Honorable Lieutenant Governor of Ontario, dignities, member of parliament, ministers, um, as I said, my adopted grandmother, <laughs> Madam McCallion, that's what I call her. She's not that old. <laughs> well... <laughs> But she's the she, that's the title I gave her. And all my friends and family, in fact, most of the people I came, I came in 1972, and I can see a lot of faces which came with me in 1972, about 45 years ago. I have never thought, I have never thought that this country will give me so much and we will be able to celebrate Canada 150. I am so thankful, with, together with all of you, that this country has given us the best. They have given best education. They have given us best health system. They have given us best jobs. And they have given us the best passport, which a lot of people from across the world come to get the passport of Canada. So it has given us. And then for the, for the thing for the Ontario, we are very lucky that it has given us Honorable Lieutenant Governor, who cares for our province so, so very much. As well, I'm very thankful to Mr. Albert Wong and my good friend Raja, who has made this afternoon possible. It's not easy. It's not easy to get the left hand governor at your home. So we as a community are grateful to these gentlemen and madam that they are here with us. I think she will say a few words and then she will come and join you. So please make the best out of her. Best out, get the pictures, but do not do what I had seen about a month ago with the, our beloved premier. People jammed over her, and there was a. So I want, I want her to be, uh, to, to. So again, thank you so much, and please be thankful and be loyal to this country. This country has given us everything. Thank you. Thank you very much, Haroon Bai. And, and as Haroon alluded to uh, very briefly, yes, so we will invite our wonderful um, Lieutenant Governor to say a few words, and then we'll have our Minister Dipika Demirla say a few words. And then uh, we will have our uh, Lieutenant Governor come down. And please, let's not hoard, let's be respectful of everybody. There are a number of seniors here as well. Uh, and uh, let's make sure that everybody's, uh, you know, having a good time meeting with people and, and get your pictures out and all this stuff. Give her a chance to grab a bite to eat as well, all right? <laughs> So at this uh, moment, I would like to invite our wonderful guest of honor, and what an honor it is to have her here in Mississauga. Please welcome Her Worship, the Honorable Lieutenant Governor of our beautiful province, Her Worship, the Honorable Elizabeth Dowdsdell. Thank you very much, and good afternoon, everyone. What a great place to spend a Saturday afternoon. Thank you. Mr. Khan, for the invitation, and uh, on behalf of, uh, of all of you as well, I'm sure. Um, members of uh, federal and provincial parliament, uh, your ex-worship, uh, my friend, Mayor McCallion, and all of our special guests, uh, both from uh, quite a distance away uh, and other parts of Canada, as well as all of you. Bonjour. Uh, uh, Bougeot. And uh, let me say that even on um, private uh, residential territory, uh, we still recognize that uh, the uh, First Nations, Inuit and Métis, were here many, many years ago and stewarded these lands. And so it's a sign of respect, particularly uh, in this location, to the Mississaugas of the New Credit. So thank you very much uh, for, uh, to them as well. This has been an absolutely wonderful year to be your Lieutenant Governor. I, uh, I normally have a busy program taking me all around the province, but this year there are so many Canada 150 events that it's been absolutely delightful. 
The One of the things I discovered very early when I was talking to people was that we don't do a very good job of telling our stories to one another. Uh, partly it's because we are a humble people and we don't like to brag about what we're interested in, what, we do, what we're doing, what we're successful about. And so I decided that I would appoint myself the province's chief storyteller. Um, and I, I did that without asking anybody permission, but it's been absolutely wonderful to learn who Ontarians really are, to learn what they're proud of, what they're pleased about, and also what they're challenged by. And certainly in the year celebrating Canada's 150th Confederation, we have much to look back on with pride uh, about the nation that we have become. But it's also a year when it's important that we take stock of, of what the challenges are that we still face and what kind of country we want 150 years from now. So one of the projects that we undertook uh, was something called 150 Stories. I asked 150 Ontarians, some of them well-known people, uh, like uh, the mayor, the ex-mayor, uh, and some just the man I met on the street in Thunder Bay. I asked them if they would write me 150 words. Now that's very short. It's kind of like an extended tweet. Um, I asked them if they would write me 150 words about what it meant to be a Canadian in Ontario or an Ontarian in Canada at this particular time. The stories are quite remarkable. Um, they have resonated with people all over the province. They give you a glimpse as to who Ontario really is. And there are two stories that, um, two themes throughout all of the stories. Because we didn't ask people to write about something particular, it was just whatever came to their minds. And one of the stories is of how important place is. And sometimes it's the nature that we have around us that's so important. And so we hear stories about Georgian Bay and things like that. But the other story that runs throughout is the immigrant story. It's the people, like most of us, who came as immigrants to this country. And the stories all have a common theme. They're, I came here because someone helped me get here, I was educated, I worked hard, I, uh, I made something of myself in this country, and now I'm giving back. And the stories are just quite incredible. They, they make the case for why belonging and inclusiveness is so very important in this country and why it's something we're all very proud of and won't give up very easily. So I brought a, a copy of uh, the book for each of you today so you can take home and, uh, and find out a little bit about your neighbours, uh, neighbours uh, in other parts of the province that you may not have been to and I hope that you'll enjoy it. But most of all, I hope that throughout the year you'll continu continue to celebrate the fact that we are a country that has grown and matured in 150 years, but more importantly that we have so much yet to do, so much better to be, certainly on our path of reconciliation with our uh, Indigenous uh, uh, neighbours and uh, colleagues, and I hope that you'll all continue to feel very much a part and very much able to make a contribution in the years to come. Enjoy the rest of the summer. Enjoy the rest of the year. Merci, miigwech. Thank you very much, Your Honor. And I'd like to invite our final speaker, and that is, uh, well, she, yeah, we know her very, very well. She does great work in our community, and that is our member of Provincial Parliament for Mississauga East Cooksville. She's also the Minister of Senior Affairs. Would you please welcome the Honorable Deputy de Merlo. Good afternoon, Your Honor and Chief Storyteller. Thank you. <laughs> uh, Madam McCallion, MPP Mangat, 
my federal colleagues. I just want to wish everybody a very happy Canada Day. I think I am going to be standing between all of you and lunch cake. or cake, yes. so I don't want to take long. I do have brief greetings from the Premier of Ontario, so if you'll allow me, I'd like to read that. On behalf of the Government of Ontario, I'm delighted to offer four warm greetings to everyone celebrating Canada. As we know, this is a particularly special day as 2017 marks not only the 150th anniversary of Confederation, but also of Ontario's achievement of provincehood. As Premier, I've had the privilege of traveling the length and breadth of Ontario, and in doing so, have developed an even deeper appreciation of our province and our country. I'm constantly impressed by, among other things, our incredible biodiversity and awe-inspiring landscapes, our peoples, talents and capabilities, our spirit of inclusion and innate respect for difference and our rich heritage culture. I wish all Ontarians and Canadians from coast to coast a very memorable Canada Day celebration and a very happy 150th birthday signed by Kathleen Wynne, Premier of Ontario. I'm going to ask Mr. and if Mrs. Harun Khan is here to accept the Premier's greetings officially. Thank you. Thank you. I just want to, on my behalf as well, wish everybody a very happy Canada and have a great summer, guys. Thank you very much, uh, Minister. And now, you know, a party's not complete. We, and I know I said that she would be the last speaker, but we got to hear it from the rock star of Mississauga, the rock star of Canada, our one and only, the woman we love so passionately, Hazel McCallion. <laughs> Oh, thank you very much, Jake. Well, Your Honor, it's such a pleasure to have you here. And as I walked around and talked to the many people, all these people, they don't all live in Mississauga, but a lot of them do, I know. Uh, I said to them, the Lieutenant Governor is a people's Lieutenant Governor. She wants to be with her people. And that's why it is so wonderful that Haroon would do this. Uh, you know, uh, not too many left on governor. governors go visit homes. Uh, they are uh, so busy visiting public, uh, public buildings. But this left governor wants to be with the people, and that's why she's here today. And isn't it wonderful? So please make a point of, of uh, saying hello to her. She wants to hear from you. She's interested. And she, that book that she came up with, it, to think that she brought you all a copy Think about it. Read it. You'll learn a lot about Ontario and Canada in that book because it's all about Ontario and, of course, Ontario being the most important province in the country, <laughs> as Mississauga is the most important city, right? Yeah, right. Anyway, uh, she's a wonderful person. As I say, a people's left hand and governor. So make sure you meet her. And thanks to... Maroon and uh, Haroon and his his family. He opens his house, Your Honor, so often uh, to people, and he has made a major contribution in bringing the South Asian people together, and to make sure that they recognize what a wonderful country Canada is. He is such a proud Canadian. He is a role model for immigrants to this country. So thank you. And thank you for coming. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yes, you can. Yes. If I can just say something, I've, I've been honored by the Honorable Lieutenant Governor to be invited at a program a couple of weeks ago at the Roy Thompson Hall. And I was the only Pakistani in 2,800 guests. Thank you very much, Madam. So what you're saying is we need to invite more. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.
I know I'm trying to swim. <laughs> 